guys, um, it's Elise here, um, and I finished the sketchbook, um, kind of a long time ago, I wouldn't say like a long, long time ago, like two days ago, so not that long, um, I already started the third sketchbook, but, um, I didn't do any major, you know, things without you guys, cause, um, Last time I checked, I think you want to see my art, so, because I got 40 subscribers. Okay, I need to calm down about that. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, um, oh yeah, this, um, is my cousin, um, she wrote a really nice note to me, um, hold on, here we go, uh, um, so, like, thank you a lot for that. Like, she, when I showed her my sketchbook, she was, like, so excited. So, yeah. Um, I've improved a lot more than this. Like, at the very end drawing, I've, like, improved so much during this sketchbook. It's unbelievable. Anyway, um, these are thumbnails for the sketches. Uh, or not the sketches, the front cover thingy. Um, and then, yeah, I don't know, this is me being random. Um, yeah, I don't, Elise was feeling sad that day, so. Um, oh yeah, this is, I, I can't find my white gel pen, so it, it's just gone, but it was surprisingly pretty bad like even with lighter colors like I feel like it showed up more in the darker colors which is weird but mm. um oh yeah and this is people from my school um they draw in my sketchbook a lot which is cool um and clearly they are all amazing artists so yeah and then this is also another one because I bring my sketchbook to school. So I, I draw on it a lot at school. Um, this is pretty bad. So yeah, it's using Crayola. So e. And then this one's okay. Because, yeah. Um, oh yeah, I did this weird thing. And I only did it for two of my OCs. So, eh. Um, it's just this random thing where I tried to make Waffles and Charles look fancy. Like, I, I don't know what I was thinking. Um, but you see fancy waffles, which is basically just waffles on a dress, so not much. Um, here is, on back of here, here is the story of the connection to all the characters. Or not all of my OCs, not Snowball, my recent OC. Um, but uh, Spike, Charles, and Waffles. Yeah, but that's Charles, and then that's Waffles, and then that's Spike. Um, so, excuse my messy handwriting. I, I'm not gonna read this, but hopefully you guys can see the whole thing. Hold on, move this. Uh, yeah, there we go. You can kind of read the whole thing. So you can just pause the video right now and read it if you want. But um, I'm just going to keep moving on if you guys don't mind. So, yeah. And then this is, yeah. And then this is when I made the OC page for Spike. Which, um, here are all his characteristics. <laughs> um, not my best drawing of him, but, you know, okay. Um, this is a random character. I keep drawing random characters, like, you know, here. Also, this is the, um, Fancy Charles. Um, used a lot of colors for that one, jeez. Um, yeah, that was just my, <laughs> ooh, markers falling. Anyway, um, yeah, I tried to draw me as a cat, which I actually did a finished illustration near the end in the sketchbook somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, um, another random girl. I think I drew her another time in the sketchbook. 
because she looked pretty cool, but she's, she's pretty basic. Oh yeah, <clears throat> me attempting to draw realistic and totally failing. <laughs> yeah, I, I cannot draw realistic, guys. Oh yeah, here she is again. Oh yeah, and this is by another person at our school um, named Amirtha. She's pretty cool. Um, and then, yeah, here she is again. I really liked her because at the time, I didn't really draw people with long hair. So I just wanted to draw people with long hair, and especially with braids. So not, not very good at drawing braids. Oh, yeah, and this is when I started my request. R request. Ugh, okay. Um, I can't speak today. <laughs> but, um, this is where people from my school, they would tell me what to draw, and I would write it down, the exact colors, everything, and I would draw it for them. <laughs> and it, it's a pretty cool thing. I actually kind of want to do it for you guys. So, if you want me to draw anything for you, and get, like, you can even get your name featured on there, like I did with my people at my school. And then I can just make it for you, anything. Um, it, it just can't, the only rules are it just can't be, like, really complex. Or, I mean, I guess not, I guess it can be as compl complex as you want it. But if it is really complex, then expect me to take some time on it. Because I have school and work and, you know, stuff, so... Just don't expect it to be done, like, the next day. Oh, yeah, and this is when I made Snowball pretty pretty early. I'd <laughs> and then um, this is my friend Katie's uh, drawing. She, it's kind of hard to move this around, but, yeah, here you can hopefully see all the words. Um, oh, yeah, this is another request. By Amirtha. I'm pretty sure you've seen her name a couple times in the sketchbook so far. Um, yeah, just random drawings. Oh yeah, this page. Oh geez, I might have to retape it, but it fell out of the of my sketchbook. Like it literally just fell out randomly. So um, my, yeah, I might have to retape it. Hold on, guys. Uh, Okay, we're done. Oof, okay. Um, yeah, but you see, it's definitely not even that reinforced. <laughs> but, um, yeah, literally, it just fell out. Oh, yeah, this is when I drew, like, comics. They're extremely cringy. So, yeah. Um, here you go, if you can see all the words. <laughs> uh, here's another one. Um, this one was pretty cool. I like this. Um, another random sketches. Another random sketches of random characters. Oh, yeah, and this is another request made by Katie at my school. Um, hi, Katie, if you're watching this. Um, or hi, Martha, or hi, anybody that was took part in this sketchbook. Um, hi. Okay, anyway, um, yeah, this is by Amirtha, um, this too, um, yeah, this is all my OCs, I don't plan on making any more, I mean, I might if I want to develop more story, but like, eh, oh yeah, this is, this is Katie's, um, comic, cause she was inspired by my comics, um, but, of course, her comics are way cooler, so. <clears throat> um, anyway, random sketches. I didn't even finish that sketch, so good job, me. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, this is um, by Liana. She actually has a YouTube channel, so I'll link it down below. Sadly, um, my other friends don't actually have YouTube channels, but um, my friend Liana does. She's actually Liana Reindeer on YouTube. Uh, she makes really good animation memes and 
clearly has really good drawing skills, like, better than mine, like, th this is me attempting to draw her, like, I'm so bad, <laughs> anyway, um, this is my gaming persona, which is, like, I don't know, <laughs> random, uh, waffles again, oh yeah, this was, um, Olivia's comic, a lot of comics in this, um, book, um, hold on, let me put this up so you can see it clearly, and then, yeah, cool, um, this is using colored pencils, because I'm not that good at coloring with colored pencils, so, like, yeah, I, I just need more practice at that, oh, yeah, this is when I made, like, a fake website, like, it's, it's not a real website, guys, don't search it up, because, I don't know, might be some bad website, I don't know, but, um, it's, I actually like the way it's turned out, that's your mouse, so you can, like, mix colors, and, like, have all these, I don't really know how the spots or markings really work, I guess maybe you, like, click on, like, where you want them, I guess, um, oh yeah, this was actually for my three color challenge, three, three marker challenge, yeah, um, I'm okay with how it's turned out, it's just not my best drawings in the world, um, yeah, just random sketches, um, oh yeah, this is my brother, I will also link his channel down below. He's likable content. Yeah, he, he makes really cool gaming videos and stuff. So, link him down below. <laughs> Linking a lot of people's channels down below. I mean, it's only two, but a lot for me. <laughs> um, this is Snowball's official OC page. Um, yeah, these are all her characteristics. Uh, that's cool. Um, yeah, cool. Oh, yeah, and this was, um, I don't know if I should make her an OC, because the problem with that is she's not a furry. I mean, I guess I could have furry OCs and non-furry OCs, but, like, I, I can't necessarily make a story with this OC. I mean, I guess it could be possible. I don't know, in a story where furries and humans are together, that that's not even really in the re real world, but... <clears throat> Um, oh yeah, this is when I tried to draw Chester in, like, a different style, I don't know, like, the lion eyes <laughs> style. Oh yeah, this girl, I decided to make her an elf, because lately I'm obsessed with elves, and you'll definitely see in the sketchbook. Uh, random things, random, random Chester stuff, random... Why, I don't, sometimes I just don't get myself, guys. Uh, anyway, um, more random stuff. Um, more random stuff. Oh, yeah, and th this was what I was talking about, like, um, a couple hours <laughs> earlier. Not hours, but whatever. Um, uh, it, it was, like, a couple pages back, I don't know. That, um, I decided to, like, make myself a human furry. Like, it's like if they join together and then this is what <laughs> happened. This girl kind of looks like Rapunzel for some reason. I don't know, because giving me the long blonde hair vibes of Rapunzel. Um, pretty cool. Oh, yeah, this is, I guess, um... She's like a superhero. She doesn't really have her own story. I mean, she does have her own story, but like, not. This is just kind of explaining her, kind of like her OC page, even though she's not really an OC. Um, then this is how I changed. Like, I do my I do my eyes with warm gray one instead of warm gray four. I think yeah, warm gray four. So you see different. This is cool, um, oh yeah, it, it's almost summer, it's not summer yet, but almost, I mean, school isn't out just yet, but close, we're getting there, oh yeah, this, this one is one of my favorite drawings, it's on the other side, but, hold on, yeah, it's the first time I've ever drawn, like, or, er, 
like colored in a whole page of markers so I, I just wanted to experiment with putting characters in backgrounds so I just put me in like a New York City kind of background ish I don't know I, I should do more of that in my next sketchbook but eh. oh yeah and this is Spike um, I was like experimenting with poses so then I was like what if I put Spike in this pose so there he is. <laughs> um, oh yeah, just putting them in random outfits. Um, oh yeah, here she is again. Don't even know her name, but <clears throat> I should probably make a name for her. Um, yeah, just random outfits, random people, tiny finished illustration, um, random stuff. Oh yeah, this is when I started to use instead of like pencil i don't know i went through this phase in a couple of pages where i just wanted to use um like m like these it was like it's supposed to be a dried up marker with this um other marker that was really thin so i was like hey this is kind of like sketching but making finished illustrations that aren't colored i, I don't know i just thought it was a great idea so i used it in a couple of pages um, tiny finished illustration here. Um, oh yeah, coming up is my, um, recent drawing I did, um, in a video. Um, yeah, she's, she's pretty cool. She's also an elf, because everything has to be an elf. Um, oh yeah, uh, this is in a video. Um, I just... Yeah, here it is. Um, I didn't do this in the video, but I put all the colors I used. So in case, I don't know, maybe if I want to draw it again, or I like one of these colors and I'm like, hey, what if I want to use it? And then I know what it is, right? So um, I do that on most of my finished illustrations, like this one. And um, I, yeah, I put the numbers instead of the actual colors. But yeah, so... And then I also did this thing. I didn't film it. I probably should have, but I mean, it's not really nice looking. I want to do a finished illustration for 40 subs or I don't know, whatever is your choice. Finished illustration and animation, anything. I don't know. Um, this one's pretty cool. I liked the idea of me like floating and having maybe like my like OCs floating with me or maybe art supplies. I don't know random idea um i also tried this style which kind of just looks more creepy the more i look at it but I, i'm not really in the mood to change my style anytime soon so like nah um another comic <laughs> wow lots and lots of comics um I was like, there's only 20 pages left. In, there's only 20 pages in the sketchbook left. That's broken English, bro. I don't know. Uh, um, yay! And then wait, what? And then, yeah, crying over just a finished sketchbook. Oh yeah, this one was actually not necessarily an art request, more of like a challenge. Uh, my friend, Amirtha, you probably heard her name like 30 times, like, I don't know, 15 um, times, but um, she challenged me to draw a fairy because I always draw elves, so why don't I draw fairies? Um, it's not really, like, small. I just wanted to, like, zoom up because I wanted to get all those details of, like, the leaf dress and the wings stuff like that i actually feel like i picked a good color combo for this because i always like green and purple and blue together i don't know i, I like cool colors so um yeah only 13 pieces of paper in the sketchbook i could have said pages but oh. oh yeah more poses and stuff i i don't know i really want to practice anatomy so i do a lot of like poses and stuff Oh yeah, this is the thumbnail for my last page in my sketchbook, so. Also there, I just realized now there's a piece of paper in here. Because I, I use pieces of paper to like, when I'm doing finished illustrations, I put a piece of paper under. So that I don't like, affect the other page. 
like right under. So, um, this is also by my cousin who did the note in the front, which is really nice of her. She's awesome at drawing. <laughs> All my friends and family are better at drawing than me, yet I'm the one who has a sketchbook. Uh, um, oh yeah, she actually um, gave me um, um, an art request, and I ripped it out and gave it to her because she wanted it. So, you guys can't, you, I mean, maybe I can show you a picture of it. I might have one, but I don't know. But anyway, um, so she wanted this, like, plant girl because... That kind of looks like her. She has like, she has she has like brown fading to blue hair, which she has in real life. So she wanted it to kind of look like her. And so these are all my thumbnails. <laughs> um, random. Oh yeah, this was a random thing I did with my cousin. It's like we made up our own school with um some of my OCs. It was pretty fun. Um. Yeah, and then this is the finished illustration, and the thing that still amazes me today is look how different this finished illustration is compared to this, you know? And I only did this in, um, uh, I don't know, I'll put the number right here because I have to use a calculator for it because I'm bad at math, but... I've improved so much in um, this number that it's just kind of, like, unbelievable. Like, I've improved a lot at outlining or light uh, line art. I've improved so much at coloring. Um, yeah, so it's just kind of amazing. But, yeah, thank you for looking in my sketchbook. And also, if you um, survived this long, <laughs> um, thank you for all, like, thank you so much, guys, for 40 subscribers. Like, oh my god, like, that's just amazing to me. Like, wow. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, thanks for looking at my sketchbook. If you like this video, be sure to like it. And comment down below what I should do for my 40 subscriber special. Because I want to make a video. Because I really, like, I am really thankful for 40 subscribers. Like, that's, that's a lot of people. Um, but yeah.